Well, Scott, congratulations, 11 in a row. How does that feel? Feels incredible for the, the, the girls to, or the club, I should say, to have um, won this title 11 times on the trot is incredible. But, you know, we did speak today about the fact that, you know, this, this is something that it will be spectacular if anyone else achieves anything like this. So no one would ever have the chance, I don't think, to make it 11 in a row. And we had that opportunity today to make it 11 in a row. So I was saying, take that opportunity because it might not come again, probably won't. So the, the way that they all handled it was so professional. They were, they were excellent from start to finish. Um, and they set their standards really, really high. And, uh, you know, I think over the, the course of the campaign, I think they've really deserved it. And over, over the course of the campaign, you know, a big turnover of players, one or two key players leaving. It was a bit of a slow start, but things got really going probably this game in May. How do you think, particularly the second half of the season, you've taken the stride on to get over the line? Well, I think that's the thing with, with a lot of the girls that have been here for a, for a number of years. Um, the second half of the campaign is where it actually exists for them. Um, and that's not to say that, that you take the first half of the campaign lightly, but it was also a very stop-start um, start to the campaign with international matches and then it was a shorter given the European Championships. Um, you know, it would be nice to, to get into more of a rhythm in the first half of the season and hopefully we can we can do that next time round. But uh, I'm totally delighted uh, with the way that they approached this game and what they've done all season. And Hibs, as ever, the challenge again. They haven't dropped points apart from Glasgow City. It's maybe a testament that they've been how close they've been today. Talked about particularly the first half. Warren and March, they always seem to score against Hibs, and it kind of chain rolled from there. And it was an excellent first half. Yeah, I mean, you know, Hibs have done fantastically well over the last few years, um, and they've managed to get their fair share of trophies as well. And you know, they're always a difficult team to play against. High energy, um, and you know, I, f I felt that you know today. We, um, we just had that little bit more of, of, of experience in the side and I felt you know players like Kreitz and you know Lero and Joe and there and Hales, they, they are players that you can rely on week in week out and you know for, for Laws to, to score as she did it's, it's, it's remarkable you know because she's got so much heart Laws and um, it, it's, it's a, a great finish you know and it, it got us going it got the whole thing started really and I think the confidence grew from there our pressing was even better from that point on um, and you know we had four really good chances again in the second half as well to, to, to add to the, the three goals but I was really pleased with, with everything and, and every one of them Obviously, celebrations today, but still work to do. One league game and then the cup against Hibs. There's been a lot of talk about that, but on the pitch, a game to be played. Still not been, you know, no one's conceded since you know the middle of May. So there's loads of things in the run now. Champions League football, so there's a lot going on still. Yeah, exactly. I know it's it's you know brilliant to know in the back of our of our minds that we have a Champions League campaign next season. It's it's great to look forward to that. We have Aberdeen still to play. We want to keep our um, unbeaten record. We want to you know keep this record of, of um, not conceding at the back, which has been been remarkable as well. Um, we want to go and win the game next week, and then um, obviously set ourselves up nicely for the the cup final. And you know we'll go into that in, in, in confident mood. Congratulations, well done today. Cheers, Callum. Thanks very much for your hard work.